Okay, guys, I thought I would um, just make a quick video and see how I went with my goals. So um, I set some goals for myself um, at the start of 2021. So January 17, I made an Instagram post. And my goals were um, all sort of centered around the, the number six. I don't know why, I just did that. Um, and I also tried to predict how achievable my goals were going to be or how unlikely my goals were going to be by a little color code system. So what I'm going to do now is going to go through them one at a time and uh, let's see if I achieve my goals for this year. Okay, so my first goal here I marked as like difficult um, and that was six signed tracks on Spotify. So as of 2020, I had two signed tracks and at the end of 2021, I did end up with six signed tracks. Um, actually a little bit more if you include all the sort of remixes uh, launched by the label. So yes, tick. Okay, the next one down, um, I had six large features in 2021. So in 2020, I had one large feature. I actually forget what that was, but who cares? Um, I marked it as difficult, but I achieved that. So um, I had a little list on my phone of sort of cool things that happened to me. So I had um, Tell Me Lies, my track um, was played on Argentinian TV like three times, that was pretty cool. Uh, my mastering engineer works at the TV station and he used to play my track on the weather report. Another thing, so I was uh, the feature artist um, on Atomic Radio in Australia. It's a huge um, like regional radio network, I guess, um, with many, many radio stations. Um, so basically I was there feature artist that was pretty cool i did a an interview on the phone at like 6 a.m german time and then they basically played that um that interview on loop um yeah for i think it was for a week or for a two weeks or something that was pretty cool um another really cool thing was um i was featured in a slovakian uh cultural magazine um as a dj which was pretty cool as well so yeah really really funny Next one, um, so the collab with Charlie Mansell and I, Give Up Your Girl, uh, that actually finished number one on the Carbon Footprint Countdown. And basically um, what that is, that's a, a, a online radio show um, where people sort of vote if they like the track or if they don't like the track. And basically our approval rating um, was 90.71 out of 100. So that was the highest rated track for the month of May. So go us, go you, Charlie, all you, brother. Um, another feature was I had several sort of um, plays on the radio and Euro America radio, especially. Thank you, Mel, for supporting my music. Um, yeah, truly appreciate that. Um, also, with uh, Give Up Your Girl, it finished, uh, well, it actually charted on Atomic Radio. Um, I think the highest it got was number 13, I think I wrote here, so that was pretty cool. Um, I had a press release on Wrecking Crew touring for um, a Parallel Universe. That was a collab with myself and Brad Ma. And um, to top it off, I finished number seven in um, Fresh Breath Records, uh, Most Fresh DJs of 2021. So thanks so much, guys, for that. Um, so I can definitely say that my second goal was ticked off. Boom. Uh, my next goal, so we're up to my third goal now, was to have 60 um, Spotify playlist placements. Uh, in 2020, I had 34. Um, yes, I smashed that. So um, I'm just looking here, the statistics just from the last 28 days. I'm currently on uh, 530 playlists. So definitely smash that one so give that a tick okay my next goal was to try and get to 600 twitch followers um that didn't go too well so at the um start of 2021 i had 74 twitch followers and right now it's january um i now have 110 twitch followers so thank you for following me on twitch if you're not following me on twitch go follow maybe i can eventually get to 600 followers who knows my next goal was to try and get 600 followers on Spotify. So in 2020, I had 239. And yes, you can see I smashed that. I finished with 1,763 followers on Spotify. So thank you all for following me. That is awesome. 
Now, my next goal was trying to get to 600 YouTube subscribers. I had 361 at the start of 2021, and I was trying to basically double that to get to 600. I came very, very close. I got to 542 subscribers. So to the 542 of you that are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy my content, my tutorials, my demo drops. I hope it all sort of helps you grow. My next goal was to try and get 600 Discord members. I had uh, 126 at the start of the year. I finished with, what, 296. So I was a long way off there. I did mark it as the orange color difficult because I thought it was a very sort of difficult goal to achieve. Um, I didn't get there, but hey, doesn't matter, you know. 300 people following me on Discord, that's truly an honor, guys. So thank you so much. So the next goal I marked as unlikely okay so this i sort of thought would have been impossible but it was to have 6,000 streams on three spotify releases so in 2020 i didn't have much music out i had no tracks that were over 6,000 streams now we have uh tell me lies 32k no clowns 13,000 thinking about you uh 17,000 give up your girl 9,000 9,000 2,000 4,000 so I've definitely smashed that goal that was a really cool one I'm proud of that so thank you guys for uh for streaming my music okay another goal I tried to get was 6,000 Instagram followers I thought it would be quite easy because at the start of 2020 I had 3,751 followers and I thought I could double that and get 6,000, but uh, it ended up being quite difficult. <laughs> um, but yeah, 5,200 followers, that is massive. And yeah, I'm proud. I mean, I set these goals, um, yeah, to try and achieve things in uh, 2021. And some I have achieved, some I have not. Let's keep going down the list, guys. Okay, my next one was also a very unlikely goal. Uh, was to have 6,000 monthly listeners at least once in 2020. So my record in 2020 was 234 monthly listeners. So um, a lot's changed since then. I've released a lot more music. I did actually achieve this goal. So at the moment, um, currently recording this video, I have 4,900 monthly listeners. I did get to 10,000 monthly listeners, guys. So check out the, uh, the uh, little... I'll put something there to sort of prove it. But yeah, pretty cool. And my final goal on the list was trying to achieve 60,000 YouTube views. So uh, at the start of 2020, I had almost 30,000 views. So I thought I could double that um, in a year. Turns out that was also extremely difficult. I list that as achievable. So perhaps I was too confident in my YouTubing abilities. Um, I did end up though, I'm very happy with 40,000 views. So that's pretty cool. Um, so there you go, guys. There's a run through of my goals uh, for 2021. You can see which ones I've achieved, which ones I didn't achieve. Um, I love setting goals because it, it gives you something to work towards uh, throughout the year. Um, you can sort of drift through life and have no purpose, no meaning. I chose to set myself some targets. Some I achieved, some I did not achieve, but hey, it kept me motivated through the year. Um, to keep working hard, keep pushing myself as an artist. And I just want to thank all of you for supporting me, following me, liking my socials, streaming my music. Um, means the world. Thank you so much. And um, have a happy new year. And um, hope you have good health, good wealth, and good something else. Ciao.